Hey guys, I'm filming this video right after the um, the last one, um, and this is about the rumors about us maybe selling Trigoria, and I think it's bullshit. So for a couple of reasons, the first is why would we do that? Okay, we're trying to build a new stadium. We're getting loads of new players in. We are um, trying, like we've been trying to rebuild our club so why would we uh, sell Trigoria? like if that's the case why would we try to build a new stadium in the first place why would we not try to make money off our players like we have been for years why would we stop that now just to sell Trigoria? seems ridiculous um, and yeah secondly we have been very like we have made quite some profits in the last couple of years, so why would we would we be in like a tough economical situation now? That should have been like in 2010, something like that. Then okay, yeah, we were probably in tough financial s situations. But why would we be that now all of a sudden? Like it doesn't make sense. And um, so yeah. Then also, Palotta is a great businessman. He's not a very good owner, but he's a great businessman. I feel like he would have gotten in, us into better finance, financial situation and wouldn't have gotten us into this mess. Like, the only reason we got into the mess with um, uh, debts and things are because Sensi was building a great team and spending loads of money. But we haven't spent loads of money on players and I feel like Palotta is a smart enough man not to lose money on this club because he only thinks about money, he doesn't care about the club. So he feels ridiculous that he would lose money. And the last like proof I have that this is probably false is there have been so much uh, bullshit coming from the media about Roma in the last couple of months, kind of. Like, it all started with uh, Monchi sacking, and from there, like, some... Oh, Monchi and Di Francesco sacking. All this chaos became, and the media pounced on that, and um, they were making stories up about the locker room atmosphere, which might be true, I don't know that, but one that we have proof, well, like, not clear proof, but, like, quite clear proof that it wasn't true, is the Totti De Rossi situation. They were talking about De Rossi wanting to kick Totti out and them being enemies and not liking each other. Which, like, is ridiculous. Because, well, first things, they, at De Rossi's farewell, they had a very genuine hug. And they were, like, like saying, exchanging some words and about the board that they didn't like them. Then also De Rossi, oh, Totti quit. Um, his job right after De Rossi was fired, or like was kicked out, um, which shows he wasn't happy with the board, might have something to do with De Rossi, but mainly it was that they recently, a video emerged of them to like, it, Totti posted a video on his Instagram of them two having a run in the woods together with, I think, Totti's son, son and someone else, maybe, can't remember. But like, yeah, so that was quite clear bullshit. Um, so yeah, I feel like this is just another media stunt to get some attention and like throw some shit at Roma because they can create more drama. Uh, Palotta came out and said this is bullshit um, and he just laughed at it. And I feel like this has been a very regular thing with him. I'm not saying it isn't definitely true. We might be in a very bad economical situation. But I don't think, like, nonetheless, I don't think we're selling tr uh, Trigoria. And I don't think it's true from the beginning. Um, like, we, we are in a difficult economical situation, that for sure. But I don't think it's, like, the worst in Serie A and stuff. If it would be, then I would be scared of bankruptcy. Because that would suck. But I don't feel like it's very likely. If 
I can see some more hard proof, then I might start believing in this more. And I would be very scared. Um, but uh, before I've seen that, I'm not going to believe any any bullshit news that comes from the media, media, especially not now this summer, after all the chaos we've had and that the media created. So yeah, uh, this was it for this video. Mm -hmm. I hope you enjoyed it. I mean, it wasn't a very positive video, but like, you still might have enjoyed it. Um, comment down below what you think. Um, and check out my Instagram for daily uh, news updates about Roma. Uh, Roma English. Uh, so yeah, I'll see you guys in the next video. And uh, bye.